Hi, this is Edmund from Sports Trading AI. So today is the 24th of uh, October uh, 2020. Uh, let's uh, take a look at the second tip of the night. Uh, before I do that, I uh, just want to make a final announcement, you know. 1st of November, the cost is going to go up to uh, 988, okay. So take advantage if you want to uh, look at the price of uh, 888, okay. So um, Let's take a look at this uh, match between uh, Exeter CD versus uh, Scan Top United. Okay, so um, handicap was opening handicap was three quarter ball opening odds one point eight six. So from one point eight six, uh, it went down to one point seven six minus ten cents, and then um, transition minus eleven cents, and then from two point zero two to one point nine zero, another twenty, uh, another twelve cents. Okay. So uh, in total, the water money was uh, 23 cents. Okay, so basically opening odds in favor of um, the home team odds movement in favor of the away team. And then for goals, this uh, STAI formula, it was 154. Okay, 154 is super, super strong home win. Uh, meaning uh, 130 above is uh, three goals and above, uh, you know. 50 is marginal home win, 90 is uh, two goals, you know, yeah. So basically for go, uh, so STI formula in favor of the home team, for the goal scoring average, uh, it was 1.33 versus zero, okay, meaning, um, you know, this, uh, this uh, home team has got a plus 1.33 superior goal average, lah, because the handicap is only one goal. So for the goal scoring average, it's in favor of this uh, Exeter City. Okay, head to head meeting, it was a convincing home win. Okay, match up, it was a win versus a loss. So, in terms of uh, banker bet statistics, uh, 4 out of 5 in favor of the home team, meaning the opening odds, the STI formula, the goal scoring average, as well as the head to head record. Okay, so whenever you have a like a three quarter ball to one one ball situation, especially if the, the opening odds is in favor of the home team, uh, meaning uh, 1.77 to one point. 1.90 lah, you know, the water money is facing the the home team. Uh, you have to be wary. Why? Because uh, when three quarter ball, a lot of people take the home team, right? But when it's one ball, there will be a lot of people actually, more people accepting the handicap. Lah. You understand? Lah? So uh, that you have to uh, do not worry that, you know, it looks as if like one side is uh, pretty heavy, but then when it's one ball, actually, the market kinds of even out, lah, you know? When the market kinds of even up, meaning those guys uh, who wanted to uh, enter at three quarter ball, uh, maybe they would probably wait for in play to enter the market. So for the pre match uh, uh, ticket, will, you know the volume will actually adjust accordingly. Uh, so it, it might not look as heavy as it is now. Uh, okay, that that's uh, the lesson I want to teach you. Okay, so basically pretty straightforward. Uh, four or five in favor of home team. We took the home team. Uh, full time result was three one. First half I think it was two nil. Okay, so basically if you see the total goal odds are one point eight eight went up to one point nine three right. So opening odds in favor of over odds movement also in favor of over. Uh. So after a while you you get used to seeing all those things. Uh. but obviously we won't enter that because the total goal scoring average is like you know. It's only 1.33 goals, uh, but because the home team has just got two goals, uh, you know, so giving one ball handicap is uh, pretty okay. And then the away team, they lost their last uh, last three away games. Uh. In fact, the last uh, last five games, only one draw and, you know, four losses. So pretty, pretty straightforward. Okay, so I hope you enjoyed this video. To find out more about the course, uh, check out the links below. Thank you. Bye-bye.